Hi, welcome back. Well, I am here right now with some really great friends, friends of Oceanside Parks. We have Victor Roy and Terry Lavero. Welcome to the show. So Thank glad you. to have you here. And we're getting ready to kick off our concert season for the city of Oceanside, right? Well, before we talk about that, let's uh, talk just a little bit about the friends of Oceanside Parks, because this is such a unique organization. And really, you all do so much work to make sure that we have fun here this in Oceanside. Is a very yeah. special organization. It is. The Friends of Oceanside Parks and Recreation is an all volunteer nonprofit, and we raise money and through sponsorships and memberships and donations year round in order to pay for the free concert series for all our residents during the summertime. And it's absolutely free, which is so good. So it really gives us, it, it gives families something to do, which is what you were mentioning early, Terry. You're saying that, Terry, that the concerts are really a family-friendly event. Is that correct? Yes, we had, oh, I don't know how old the folks were, but <laughs> uh, there were babies came along or children who were walking and dancing and Aww. skipping around. And uh, there were a few well-behaved dogs there too. Okay, okay. And they were mostly lying still. Okay. But we, we had uh, our first concert um, on Friday, and we had the Mardells were the featured act, and people were up and dancing in the aisles, and some folks brought their own picnic suppers, but we also had uh, uh, food trucks and vendors from local restaurants. Yes. So if someone didn't have time or they got a little bit hungrier, uh, there was still food that they could get and enjoy. Which is so good. Okay, so what's our, what's the, what's the, the lineup for this year then? Oh, it's exciting. Our next big concert will be mid-July, July 20th, and that is Greg Douglas and his band. He's Rock and Roll Hall of Fame right. with, from Steve Miller. Okay. Band days. Okay. He plays a great sound, and people get up and dance with his music too. Good. So. We encourage everybody to come out, bring your family, bring your friends, bring all the kids, yeah. because it's fun. Yes, it is. All right, so we have July 20th, and what else do we have? We have the, well, we have mid-August, Okay. and we also have uh, mid-September. Very good, oh, awesome. And the great thing about this is this is a free event mm -hmm. that, uh, and so that, which is why you all work so hard mm -hmm. to, to make sure this happens, but, right? But we're also here to promote, our, we have a concert every Sunday in July, starting July 1st. Oh. And those concerts start at 4 p.m., so in the later afternoon until 6, mm -hmm. under the beautiful trees of Heritage Park. Mm -hmm. So come on out to that too. There are food vendors, and it's a lot of fun. And we try to bring in community groups for, for entertainment. Okay. Heritage Park has a lovely gazebo at the center, and there are some uh, vintage buildings. They were moved from other spots of Oceanside, mm -hmm. and um, they are surrounding the, our park area. Yes. And the park, it's so flat, and it's really accessible. Um, some folks bring children who are in wheelchairs, mm -hmm. or other people who need walkers, or who need wheelchairs, it's really easy for them to negotiate to this park. get in and get out, yeah, that's mm -hmm. true, that's true. And we, we have an old time ice cream parlor too. Oh. Um, so people can, if, if it's a warm summer day, they can get a nice refreshment there. Oh, that's good. What's exciting about Heritage Park is just recently, within the last several months, uh, we have reopened the Johansson House and Museum. Oh, wow. And it is spectacular, worth coming in to just see that. We also have the Model Railroad Society guys, mm -hmm. and that's usually open when we have our concerts. But I also want to let you know, Elaine, that the Friends provided a $1,000 scholarship to one of our high school students in Oceanside this year. Wow, that's really good. So we really are fortunate good. to do that. Wow. And uh, let's see. And our season concludes in November every year with the Fall Festival and Chili Cook-Off. So there are events that go on practically every single every month. Every single month, yeah. And we, 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 before we leave, we have to make sure that we say a big thank you to someone very, very special. That's to Miss, Mrs. Eileen Turk, who yes. was the director of the uh, Parks and Rec Department in Oceanside, who recently retired. We're going to miss her, but the good news is she is volunteering with the, the Friends of Oceanside Parks and Rec. 
So we're hoping that she stays on with us for, you know, a long time a to long come. Time, yeah. In between her travels. Yeah, <laughs> in between. Her. <laughs> and of course, the overall model is uh, parks make life better. They do. Very good. Thank you so much. Parks do make life better. And the Oceanside, the parks right here in the city of Oceanside will make your life better too. So make sure you get involved. Bring your family out and enjoy the concerts in the park for this summer.